Hello, this is Mary with All Things Automotive, bringing you here today the 2021 Ford Expedition Max Limited. This vehicle features a 3.5 liter V6 engine with four wheel drive. There have been no accidents or damages reported to Carfax, and this is a Carfax certified one owner vehicle. As we get closer to the front of this vehicle, you'll be able to see that it is a bright red with chrome and black accents, as you'll be able to see there on the grill and down around those fog lights. Those fog lights will help you out in inclement weather, and speaking of inclement weather, let's come around to the side and take a look down at those wheels. With this vehicle, you do have silver 20-inch aluminum alloy wheels with black insets. And as for your tire treads, All Things Automotive does guarantee at least double the state minimum or better. But I'll get you those exact measurements in just a second. As this vehicle, along with all the other vehicles here at All Things Automotive, has undergone a new multi-point inspection, as well as received a fresh oil change, a new cabin air filter, and a new engine air filter. So you don't need to worry about replacing any of those anytime soon. I would like to point out right here on the end of your mirror caps, you do have your turn signal indicator integrated into those. And on the inside, you do have a blind spot indicator, which will just light up if there's anyone in your blind spot, helping you to drive just a little bit safer. I'd also like to point out that here on the door handles, you do have passive keyless entry. That is really handy because if your vehicle is locked and you have your keys in your pocket or purse, you'll be able to enter your vehicle without having to take them out. I'd also like to point out on the bottom of this vehicle as we go inside, you will have running boards automatically fold out to help you get in and out of the vehicle. And once you close your door, they'll fold right back up. We'll now take a look here in the inside of the vehicle. Here on the inside, you'll be able to see you do have this lovely black ebony leather in the inside for an easy cleanup. And I'll just look inside the glove box to bring out the results of that multi-point inspection I was talking about. As you can see for your tire treads, you do have 6 30 seconds in both the front tires and 7 30 seconds in both the rear tires. And as for your brake pads, you have 10 30 seconds in the front and 10 30 seconds in the rear. I'd also like to point out that with the purchase of this vehicle, you do get the owner's manual with it. If you have any questions, you'll be able to look them up in there. I'll now come around now to the rear occupant seating. Well, right here we are in the rear occupant seating, and as you can see, that ebony leather is back here as well. This vehicle can seat a total of eight people, and I would like to point up because this vehicle does come with a dual pane panoramic sunroof. Back here for these rear occupants, you do have a climate control system, two cup holders there, as well as rear heated seats and power outlets. You also have power outlets and power adjustments for the back row seats as well. I'd also like to point out you do have pockets on the back of those front seats. And as for the door, you do have cup holders and storage compartments on all of the doors as well as powered windows. We'll continue to make our way around the vehicle. Now to the back. If you take a look down here at the bottom of this bumper, you'll notice you do have a tow bar already installed if you wanted to have a small trailer hitch hookup or a bike rack. And you might also notice several dots there. Those are your rear proximity sensors. They'll let you know if there's anything behind you whenever you're backing up or parking. And to go along with that, you do have a backup camera as well. We'll now take a look inside the trunk of this vehicle. As you can see, you've got a fair amount of space, but I also just want to point out these buttons right here because with the push of a button, these seats all fold down without you having to go in and fold them down manually. Very convenient if you want to have some very large loads or large items put in. As you can see, you've got a significant amount of space back here. I'll also point out that you do have anchor points if you wanted to strap down large items to keep them from shifting around as you drive. And you also have an extra storage compartment underneath the floorboards for any tools or important items you want to store down there. This rear lip tailgate is powered, so with the push of a button, that also comes down. I'd also like to mention that with the purchase of this vehicle, you do get two keys, both with a remote start for your convenience. Before we head in the vehicle, I would like to also point out that you do have those chrome roof racks on top as well. You do have a door code with this vehicle to make sure you never get locked out. And on the inside, you do have powered mirrors and powered windows as well as powered door locks. And as for your driver's seat, you do have eight-way power adjustments so you can move it forward, backwards, up and down, tilting forward and back, and then two-directional lumbar support. And on the steering wheel, you do have a telescopic steering wheel, so you can move that in and out as well as up and down to make sure it fits you. And to the left of your steering wheel is just your dashboard backlight and headlight controls. The last thing I would like to mention is over here on the door. 
This vehicle does come with a memory system for your power seating adjustments, which is really useful if there's more than one driver for this vehicle. Basically, all you need to do is to set your seating adjustments for the first time, and from then on, with the push of a button, they'll return to those same seating adjustments without you having to fiddle over and over again. I'll now get in the vehicle and turn it on for you. This vehicle is a push to start. All right, now that the engine's on and the dashboard's lit up, you'll be able to see that this vehicle has about 47,320 miles on it. We'll take our focus over here to the steering wheel as it is heated, and on the left side you do have your dashboard navigation buttons, so with these you'll be able to cycle through all of the information and services this vehicle provides. Right underneath those you do have your cruise control settings, and then to the right side of the steering wheel you have your volume settings, as well as Bluetooth and call control as this vehicle does have smartphone integration. We'll take our attention now to the center of the vehicle. Here in the center of the vehicle you do have a lovely LCD touchscreen. And this vehicle does come with built-in navigation. I'll just throw this vehicle in reverse to show you that backup camera in action. Right underneath that LCD display, you do have your volume and radio settings. And underneath that, you do have your climate control settings with heated and cooled driver and passenger seats. Underneath that, you do have a USB charging port as well as a wireless phone charger built in. Continuing down the center, you do have your gear shift there, your four-wheel drive shift, and two cup holders. And here you do have that main center storage compartment. This does come out, and you do have another power outlet there. We'll take a look up, because up here you do have your garage door openers built in there. And then here are your sunroof controls, and I'll just push that back for you to show you how well that looks. We'll now move on to the last section of the video. In the last section of the video, we do want to address that this vehicle is pre-owned, so we'll be looking around for any blemishes, nicks, or stains. We know a lot of our customers come from very far away, and so we want to make the purchasing process as straightforward and transparent as we possibly can. We want you to know exactly what you're getting with the purchase of this vehicle, imperfections, and all. So the only thing that has majorly stuck out to me is that you do have a stain here on the ceiling in the rear occupant seating. But other than that, nothing has really stood out to me. Aside from looking very closely, there are some small stains in the rear occupant seating as well. Some small stains back here. But other than those, I cannot really see anything else. So we'll continue around the vehicle, now to the outside. Here on the rear driver's side door, you do have a scratch there. And we'll continue around, now to the front. You do have a small scratch there. On the front here, you do have several small nicks and stains. Those nicks and stains are most likely from stone chipping. Stone chipping is extremely common. Almost every vehicle has them. The only way you can really prevent stone chipping is just by not driving your vehicle. We'll continue along now to the passenger side. You do have a nick there. You do have a slight scratch there on the passenger side door. Another slight scratch. We'll continue along the back. Here along the bumper is typically where there are a lot of scratches and nicks as people don't take care of putting items in and taking items out. And that is the case for this vehicle as well. We do have scratches here, as well as stains and several nicks. We'll close this tailgate and continue moving around. You do have a good nick there. And we're back to where we started. This concludes the video vehicle tour. This vehicle has a lot of great features to offer. If you're interested in a red four-door wagon with the ability to seat eight, electronically folding seats with a lot of space in the rear, chrome roof racks and electronically folding running boards, 
dual pane panoramic sunroof and four wheel drive and tons of extra trimmings such as a heated steering wheel, heated front and rear seats, passive keyless entry, a wireless phone charger, garage door openers and so much more. This is a good option for you. If you're interested in this vehicle, come and check it out at All Things Automotive. Located at 21518 Great Cove Road, McConnellsburg, PA. Or you can give us a call at 717-485-4224. You can also check out this wagon and other listings on our website at www.allthingsautomotive.com. Thank you for watching this video and have a great day.